Hey, welcome back to Nathan for Sewer Games. We're not going to kill Torrin this time. Playing Torrin's Passage. Uh, my favorite adventure game. Or one of them. Probably up there. We need peat moss and slugs to feed a man. That's probably illegal. Yep, you got it. Yep. Uh oh. Did you just say, oh shit? <laughs> I'm pretty sure he did. I'll grab it. Oh! You'd be better off worrying about getting off that rope than reaching for your bag. Well, I'll just. It was there. Alright. Swing, Torin. Swing, Torin. It's just, it's just about clicking a lot. Grab it! I can only reach that. You just did reach it. Grab it, grab it, grab it! Only... Torin, I swear I will kill you. There you go. You want? Why did you pitch the rope? You can do it, buddy. Come on, come on, Torin. Yay! Now how am I gonna get my bag? I knew all that roof jumping in the beginning was worth it. And my parents said I'd never Ooh, amount to stop. anything. What? What? Boogle, you son of a... How could you? Boogle? You mean this whole time you could have walked right out on that bog? Yeah, really? What? Only when it's funny, huh? Pardon? Well, only when it's funny, you. <laughs> Oh, you never asked, to be fair. You never said, boo, can you go get the, the nasty, whatever this crap is. Yum yum. It's about to be lunch. Alright. Okay, so we need those slugs. Uh, don't swim. Boo, you, you, that, that, we don't know where that water's been. All right, let's get him. Yeah, now go get him. Uh, what if we put Boogle as like a trap? Oh. Well, okay, maybe the slugs. Slugs and snails are like the same thing, right? What if I just took them? Hey, you guys, want to be dinner? Hey. Say, guys, could you help me with those slugs over there on the next tree? I can't even get close to them. Yeah. How can I trap them? Trap him? Yeah, you could. If you had fate. Yeah. We know just what they like, don't we, Slime? I got lots of stuff. Sure do, Slim, but we can't tell you. Square roots. What? Why not? I'm honest, trustworthy, sincere. Oh, it's not that. Nah, it's because you haven't done anything for us yet. What could I do for you? You snails. Just turn over a new leaf. Oh. <laughs> Turn over a new leaf. Good one, Slim. Yeah, good. Thanks, Slime. Good one, guys. <laughs> now tell me how I got the friggin' slugs. What, that was it? While I'm not totally unfamiliar with 12 step programs, <laughs> that's, that's actually pretty good. Meant by turn over a new leaf. Well, that's what he meant was we need a new leaf to practice our pair's figure sliming. Yeah, a big leaf. A really big leaf. Okay. You know, something with style. Class. Chlorophyll. Retsin. Something to give us that competitive edge. Oh, yes, something who? that will put us over the top, slime-wise. Slime-wise. Yeah, you got anything like that? Uh-huh. Check out this. Yuck. If we wanted Pete, we'd crawl there. Uh, what this guy? Hey, get out of here. Yeah. We don't need no inchworm to tell us. This leaf ain't big enough for the three of us. You're not on a leaf. You're on a... How about this? Cute. Root. They have a response there. This is good. Oh, I don't take... The... What about the axe? What are you trying to do? Serve sliced escargot? Yeah. Do you think he'd know this? Okay, fine. So you need a big leaf. Well, this tree seems void, so... Yeah, nice handstand there, buddy. Oh, little trick. You can right-click to make Torrin teleport, which I will now be doing since you've all seen what's uh, over here already. Oh, here's some leaves. Let's take this that one. might be the biggest leaf here, 
but then again it might not let's play a pre-rendered versus active object game which leaf out of all of these viewers at home do you think is the correct leaf which one sticks out like a sore thumb which one is very obviously this might be the biggest leaf here but then again it might not okay oh we'll use the inchworm the telus because that's racial stereotyping. Oh, nice call. Thanks, Inch. That inchworm with no length. Mr. Worm to you. Quanta hey, is a leaf. Back here. Hmm. Now, which one is it? Which one? That one. Oh, not again. Gotcha. Oops. Why did it go? Did you fart on it? Oh, Ooh, yuck. Whoopsie. Hey, Boogle, get that, will ya? I'm sorry, little friend. Have fun in warm heaven. Oh. oh. Apparently, what? What? Boogle? Learned how to become a worm? Oh, that's not creepy. Hey, guys, it's me, Boogle. What else is this? What's this? Boogle. Google lamp. I'm sure all these things will come in handy. I got that leaf, right? Is it the biggest leaf? Well, it just says largest leaf, so I'm gonna assume that that is the case. I should probably save the game. I haven't saved yet. Boogle. That seems like a good name. Hey guys, I got your stupid leaf. Here you go. I found it, boys. This is the biggest leaf in all the woods. You? You did? Yeah. You brought us a leaf? Yeah. I mean, bro. Yep. And here it is. We can now hang. Tell me about those slugs. How can I capture them? Yeah. Ooh, nice texture. What? What? Nice structure. Talk about slugs or the leaf? Size. Professional markings. Okay. It's a deal. Yep. Done deal. You want a I five? Uh, yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Your loss. Okay. Uh, I love it. Slugs, love, scum. Oh, let me write this down. Slugs, love, scum. Bog scum? No, definitely moat scum. That's what you want. Oh, yeah. Moat scum is choice. I went in the moat. Too bad you can't get it. What do you mean, can't get it? I know where the moat is. Yeah, you know where, but do you know what? What? <laughs> like, what's in that moat? Croctopus. Oh, yeah. Croctopus, and lots of them. Wouldn't lots of them be croctopi? Croctopi, croctopuses, yeah, don't matter. Croctopi. You'll never get close enough to the water to get scum from the moat. Wait a minute. Didn't you say you were going to the moat Olympics? Yeah, why? I'll take well, you there. If I took you over there, would you help me get some moat scum? Slim, what do you think? Okay by me. Better than crawling. Okay, big boy, let's go moatin'. Here, hop on your leaf. The Moat Olympics. Like the Special Olympics, but for snails. Hey, guys. Now I'm going to feed you to that guy, because I decided that... All right, no, I'm not going to feed you to the crazy dude whose house I visit frequently who keeps wanting food. You can just go warp. Down we go. Off to the moat. When I was a child, this is me. I always wondered what was past there. In the majestic world of Torrance Passage. I also wondered what was in Crystal City because they never let you go inside. Fun fact, in the original advertisement for this game, it was pitched as a new series from Outlaw. Like they were going to make multiple games. And if you go to Outlaw's website, he talks about this game and says that it was going to be a series. But Sierra, because adventure games are falling out, this ended up being the last adventure game that he, he technically made. It's just kind of sad. It's a good one. I would love to see a series. But considering how the game wraps up, it might have been hard. 
There's your useless Nathan are, fact. Boys, the site of the next Moat Olympics. I hope you win the gold medal. Thanks, Torin. You're okay for such a dry person. I know I'm using my yeah, empty purse sprint today. And in return, I'll put in a good word for you with some of my croctopus friends. Good word? Thanks. I don't need good words. I need moat scum and plenty of it. Oh, you do, do you? And exactly where do you want it? In my inventory? Right up here. What, Google? Shut hey, up. Croc, pass the boy some scum. Whoa. I've seen enough hentai to know where this is go Oh, never mind. Ugh. I'm not going to comment on that. Please tell me this is moat. So that's where moat scum comes from. That explains a lot. A lot of things I wish had gone unexplained have now been explained. Okay, so wait. What did I need the scum for? Oh, the slugs. Okay, right. I was like, he doesn't eat the scum. Alright, I got my bait. Well, I guess I'll just leave this delicious moat scum right here for a while. That's a bird. There it goes again. They don't speak English, Torrin. They're slugs. Go! Oh, biffed it. Those slugs are so fast. I'll never catch them like this. <laughs> if only I can make a trap. Man, those slugs are too quick. If I can make, use the bag, make a trap. Use the booga box. Boogle, can you make a box right over that moat scum? Uh -huh. Why is he like talking on one side of his mouth? I got a scum. Alright. Now we wait. That bird's going backwards. What? This world's gone mad. Okay, Boogle. Make it happen. That's it, Boog. Now we've got him. Now we got you, you little. For you, guys. you little. Twits. Well, what? Where'd they go? Thanks, Boogle. Oh. oh, we ate them and then barfed them back up like a mother bird to its children. Wow, that a mess of slugs is right. Let's go feed it to Captain Crazy Pants. Hopefully, he doesn't need anything else because I'm pretty sure I've exhausted all my options in this single horizontal plane of adventure. Yep. In we go. What's up, bro? I got your stuff. Here's your order, sir. Slugs and peat moss, just as you requested. But boy, did I have to go through a lot just to bring these to you. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. You probably just walked around that cliff to the deli. What? What? You mean... <laughs> just a little guardhouse humor, boy. Ain't no food within days of this place. Oh. Now get over there in that kitchen and rattle them pots and pans. I'll be rattling. All right, but this is my first attempt at cooking such a delicacy. Dad, would you like string out the slugs? Because <laughs> I mean, the peat moss balls are easy. Just make little balls, right? I mean, but like to kill the slugs? Well, at least it's quick to prepare. Here you are, monsieur. Bon appetit. What's using? Yeah, what? Where's the... Ugh, did you, like, gut the slug? Ugh, yum yum. You eat that right up, big boy. Now, can we get on with it? Yeah, I'm ready. Now, the perfect conclusion to a near-perfect meal. Dessert. And a nice latte. Dessert. I'm feeling you on that latte. Latte? Oh, I know no. I'm gonna get a latte. Oh, stop your griping. You can skip the latte. Okay, Just thanks. Just bring me some dessert. Huh. All right. What'll you have for dessert? Dessert. Why, there's only one thing that'd top spaghetti and peat balls. I'm afraid to ask. Root. Yeah, what? Let's make sure. Wait, I got one of those. I got one of those. I got one of those. A root. Then will I be done? Bingo! Bright boy. Yep, good old root would be just fine. So just want it raw or I mean here's your root, bro. Here you go. 
one large root. Want to help me fix it? No, I'll just wait right here. Thanks. Somehow I guessed as much. You're a lazy hey, bastard. Nice square shape too. Them's the best kind. Okay, how about if I make it into a pie? <laughs> Does anyone get the upcoming joke? That's how I make pies. Hammer, saw him. Great. While that's in the oven bacon, why don't you and I head back to the Phenocrest chamber? The what? Ah, what did you say to me? Smell that aroma. The what chamber? You know, there's nothing like coming home to find the square root pie. Phew. Say, ya, uh, we going out on that joke? No, we're going out through the secret passage. Oh man, this game just keeps throwing zingers at me. The square root pie, math. Whoa, that's some 3D Wait, you graphics. Get something. All right. Pick a shard. Any shard. What? <laughs> I've been waiting 15 years to use that line. But which one do I pick? That one is little, but the white top. Is he giving me the finger? In shards? I'm on to your game. Well, I'm going to contemplate this decision. The next time on Nathan vs. Video Games, we will pick a shard. Any shard. You don't want to miss it. You don't want to miss it. 